The buzz around DJI's next ultralight drone is reaching a fever pitch, and it's no surprise why. The upcoming DJI Mini 5 Pro is not just a modest upgrade over its predecessor, it's shaping up to be a true game changer in the world of sub 250G drones. Thanks to a steady stream of leaks, FCC filings, and early glimpses in the wild, we now have a much clearer picture of what to expect from this highly anticipated drone. And from what we've seen, DJI is ready to push the boundaries of what's possible in the ultralight drone category. One of the most astonishing revelations so far revolves around the Mini 5 Pro's battery. According to a recently surfaced FCC certification document, the drone will pack a 4,680mAh battery rated at 33.5WH. This is a significant leap from the battery capacities found in the Mini 3 Pro and even the Mini 4 Pro. For perspective, the Mini 4 Pro offered a base flight time of 34 minutes, which could be extended to approximately 47 minutes with the Intelligent Flight Battery Plus. But the Mini 5 Pro, it could potentially fly for 50 to 55 minutes, making it the first sub 250G drone to flirt with an hour of airtime under ideal conditions. This is more than just an incremental improvement. It's a groundbreaking leap that could redefine expectations for lightweight drones. If DJI manages to pair this battery with their existing 65W fast charger, we could see not only longer flights but significantly faster charging times. A dream come true for content creators and hobbyists who rely on quick turnaround times. While the battery is impressive, the camera might just be the star of the show. According to leaks, the DJI Mini 5 Pro will sport a new 1-inch image sensor, a significant upgrade over the 1x1. 3-inch sensor used in the Mini 4 Pro. This larger sensor size means better light sensitivity, improved dynamic range, and sharper image quality. For aerial photographers and videographers, this change opens the door to more professional-grade footage, even in low-light conditions. Another notable design change is the camera's mounting system. The gimbal now appears more exposed and lacks the protective side flaps that were standard in previous Mini models. This new design could allow for full 360-degree camera rotation, giving users much more creative freedom. It's a concept that seems inspired by the Mavic 4 and DJI Osmo Pocket Series, products known for their cinematic flexibility. Complementing the upgraded camera is a new, more capable gimbal system. It's expected to offer smoother motion, more axes of movement, and better stability overall. DJI seems to be focusing heavily on providing users with cinema quality movement and flexibility, which would make the Mini 5 Pro perfect for everything from travel vlogs to indie filmmaking. Safety and navigation also appear to be getting a major overhaul. The Mini 5 Pro will likely be the first in the Mini series to feature front-facing LiDAR sensors as part of DJI's 3D infrared sensing system. These sensors are capable of detecting obstacles up to 25 meters away with a wide 60-degree field of view. And here's the kicker, they're optimized for low-light navigation, which means safer flying even in dim environments like dusk or dawn. The drone's body will reportedly include larger sensor bulges to house these enhanced systems, while still maintaining enough clearance for the gimbal to move freely. DJI's thoughtful engineering e ensures a balanced combination of innovation and practicality. Under the hood, the DJI Mini 5 Pro is rumored to feature stronger motors with visible ventilation, a first for the Mini series. This improvement could significantly boost wind resistance, improve in flight stability, and even allow for heavier payloads, like more powerful cameras or accessories. Adding to the usability factor, the drone will feature quick-release propellers, eliminating the hassle of dealing with tiny screws. This makes both setup and maintenance far more user-friendly. Despite all these upgrades, DJI has ensured the Mini 5 Pro remains lightweight, compact, and foldable, true to the ethos of the Mini lineup. Forget your SD card? No problem. The Mini 5 Pro is expected to come with 32 GB of internal storage, a thoughtful addition that provides a safety net for those moments when you leave your Mycroft behind. In terms of transmission, 
the drone will use DJI's O4 system, which can deliver a control range of up to 20 kilometers, putting it on par with higher-end models like the Air 3 and Mini 4 Pro. The drone will also be compatible with the RC2 controller, RCN3 motion controller, and DJI Goggles 3 or Goggles N3, opening up options for both traditional pilots and FPV enthusiasts. Leaked features hint at a suite of smart functionalities that could take user convenience to the next level. One exciting rumor is voice control, similar to what we've seen in DJI's Neo model. This would allow users to control key functions hands-free, making it perfect for vloggers or creators capturing spontaneous moments. There's also talk of in-app screen recording and a dedicated flight mode button, which could trigger preset cinematic moves without the need for deep menu navigation. These additions show that DJI is listening to its user base, particularly the new generation of mobile content creators. A major advantage of the Mini series has always been its compliance with regulatory limits, especially staying under the 249G threshold, which exempts it from FAA registration in the US for recreational use. DJI appears to be maintaining this sub-250G design with the Mini 5 Pro, which is a crucial feature for casual users. There are also rumors of lightweight propeller cages, similar in style to those used on the DJI Flip. These additions could help the Mini 5 Pro meet Category 1 requirements for flying over people without needing special waivers. This is a massive benefit for filmmakers and journalists who often find themselves in unpredictable shooting environments. While the drone's folding mechanism remains similar to the Mini 4 Pro, the addition of fixed propellers and optional cages might slightly affect its folded size. Some speculate that the drone arms could twist inward to align with DJI Flip's more compact design. Either way, DJI appears focused on maintaining portability without sacrificing safety or performance. Initially, top DJI insiders like Jasper Ellens and Hokusushi predicted a September 2025 launch. But with the recent FCC filing and leaked field test footage, an earlier launch date of August 7, 2025, is now looking more likely. DJI might be accelerating production and certification to avoid potential disruptions tied to a looming US regulatory crackdown, which could ban DJI products if a national security review isn't conducted by the end of 2025. As for pricing, the base package featuring the RCN2 controller and a single battery is expected to be around $850 US dollars. A fly more combo version which includes the RC2 controller with a built-in display and other accessories, could retail for as much as $1,200 US dollars. This places the Mini 5 Pro between the Mini 4 Pro around $759 and the Air 3S near $1,000, offering strong value given its advanced capabilities. If DJI delivers on its promises, a 1-inch sensor, a 360-degree gimbal, extended flight time, and next-gen obstacle avoidance, the DJI Mini 5 Pro could easily become the new gold standard for compact drones. It has the potential to bridge the gap between beginner-friendly flying machines and professional-grade aerial platforms. From travel bloggers and content creators to seasoned drone pilots and cinematographers, the Mini 5 Pro looks ready to satisfy a wide spectrum of users. Its blend of power, portability, and smart functionality challenges the very limits of what a sub-250G drone can achieve. As the countdown to launch begins, one thing is clear. The DJI Mini 5 Pro isn't just an upgrade, it's a revolution in ultralight drone design.